You're listening to Soap Dirt, the latest in television entertainment news. Hey there, soap opera fans. This is Soap Dirt, and we've got your latest edition of General Hospital Daily Spoilers for next week, March 20th through 24th. 2023. There's a bunch of things to see, a bunch of action happening. We've got people leaving. We've got plots afoot. We've got people waiting for consequences. There's just a whole lot to unpack here. So let's dig right in. On Monday, March 20th, 2023, we're in season 60, episode 131 of General Hospital, and we have Michael Corinthos opening up to Brooklyn Quartermain. There's little doubt what he's going to be talking to BLQ about. It's got to be the impending wedding and possible impending death of his bride-to-be. Of course, Liesl Obrecht is ready to donate some bone marrow to get her leukemia under control, but will they approve her to donate to Willow? We'll have to wait and see. For right now, it's touch and go, and Michael is really stressed because he's facing the fact that if he loses her, he's going to be a single dad to two little kids, and it's just all heartbreaking. Also on Monday, Valentine and Anna have a disagreement. Tensions are running really high at the safe house. Everybody's got cabin fever. Everybody's climbing the walls. And in fact, that same day, Lucy Co. makes a big move. She wants out of there. She wants her hand on the nurse's ball, and she is climbing the walls. Uh, it looks like Martin Gray's time rolling around in the hay with her is not quite enough to distract her. She wants out. Valentine and Anna are disagreeing. It's all so messy. And of course, it's all Victor Cassadine's fault. Also on Monday, Willow Tate has a request for someone. We'll have to wait and see because she's already locked in her maid of honor and all that that's going on. So we'll have to see what it is. Also on Monday, Sunny has a tough choice to make. And we're expecting that this might have to do with Dex Heller since they've been getting closer and they just saved each other's life. So there's a whole bunch of mob tension going on. Then on Tuesday, March 21st, 2023, on General Hospital, it's episode 132 of season 60. And Michael's going to find out something that really shocks him. Hmm. So we're back to, is this about Dex and Sonny? Is he going to find out that Dex got shot? There's a whole bunch at play with that revenge storyline. Also on Tuesday, Drew Kane offers his expertise to someone. So we'll have to wait and see on that. Will it be Carly? Will it be someone else? Meanwhile, also on Tuesday on General Hospital, Chase takes some advice from his ex, Willow. We know that he is sticking with the music business to try and help out Blaze because she's dealing with Creepy Link, but he's also actively trying to get back to his job as a cop. So we're just going to have to see what advice she offers him. Also on Tuesday, Maxie Jones is ready to help out a friend. Which friend? Hmm. We'll have to wait and see. That same day, Dante Falconeri is worried and he voices his concerns. Then it's midweek on General Hospital, Wednesday, March 22nd, 2023, and it's season 60, episode 133 of GH. That day, we're going to have BLQ making a confession. She's done so much shady stuff. We'll have to see what that confession is and to whom. That same day, there's a big run-in between Trina Robinson and her maybe daddy, Curtis Ashford. And it's very awkward because she at first rejected out of hand the idea of having the DNA test, but it's inevitable. We know it's going to happen and everybody's torn because, of course, Taggart is her father as far as she's concerned, but biologically there's another link there, but it's also messy being estranged from her mom because of the wedding day reveal. Also midweek, we've got Nina Reeves asking questions from Jordan Ashford. Now, is she going to ask Jordan about the situation with Curtis because Nina and Curtis are so close? Or is this about the whole insider trading thing that she has realized is the fear of Drew and Carly? We'll have to wait and see because she definitely still wants payback on Carly. Also midweek, Esme Prince is looking at her options. Remember Laura and Kevin this week made a pitch to her to have them raise baby Ace Chamberlain Cassadine. I don't know. They haven't revealed his last name. And she wants the baby there with her. She definitely loves the baby. But Spencer 
Laura and Kevin, none of them want to see that baby in jail, even though it's, you know, not a prison prison. It's more of a low key facility, but still. So she's going to reconsider things. Also, Elizabeth Weber is worried about the outcome. She's waiting to find out if the shady things she did and the plea deal she took are going to affect her standing as a nurse at General Hospital. So she's definitely tense about that and Fenn's there supporting her. Going into Thursday, March 23rd, 2023 on General Hospital, we're in episode 134. That same day, Spencer steps up to reassure Trina. Maybe she's on pins and needles herself worrying about this paternity test, but Sprina is starting to heat up and everybody's excited about that. And he is definitely going to be there for her in any way that she needs him. That same day on Thursday, Alexis is shaken. Perhaps Gregory Chase finally comes clean about exactly what's going on with him. It's clear that he's got a fatalistic attitude and he's certain he's going to die and that there's nobody that can help him. But let's not forget that his son, Hammy Finn, is a top-notch doc. And if Gregory would come clean, maybe he could help him. So if that is what Alexis finds out, maybe she'll press him to pursue alternatives that he doesn't think are open to him right now. Also on Thursday, Sasha Gilmore confronts Gladys Corbin. She takes her off guard. Of course, Gladys basically made up a story about selling the garage to Selena Wu, but she didn't sell that garage. There's going to be no money coming into the bank account because she handed it over to satisfy gambling debts. And no matter what Gladys says, what she's done is indefensible and she's lying and she's going to get caught. There's no doubt about it. Meanwhile, Marshall Ashford spends some time with Portia Robinson and he's got some kind words for her. As we know, despite her betraying and lying to his son, he's been very understanding because he also betrayed Curtis with years of lies. So he is very supportive of her and he's trying to put the family back together. Maybe he'll make some progress. Also on Thursday, Maxie makes an offer to Cody Bell. Of course, Cody is still hiding the fact that Mac is his biological father. And that's information that Maxie would really like to have. And there's no way she'd keep quiet. So maybe she'll find out a little something from him. As the week closes on General Hospital, it's Friday, March 24th, 2023, Season 60, Episode 135. We've got Cam Weber leaving town soon. He's going to go to Stanford. He is exiting the soap. Cam has a run-in with Joss. He's tried to be friendly with her. He's tried to be supportive. He's very angry that she cheated with Dex. He's also... And in a bigger way, more worried about her beyond the whole cheating and dumping him thing. He's very worried about her because he knows she has never liked Sonny's mob activities, but here she is acting like Carly Jr. and gotten herself involved with a mob man. However, she's optimistic that Dex is going to get out of this mob life and they're going to have some kind of happily ever after. But if you've watched enough Godfather movies, you know, you try to get out and they pull you back in. So we'll have to wait and see. Also on Friday, Esme is still skeptical. Maybe Spencer comes back and tries another pitch, but she's definitely giving him side eye. Also, someone shows up to see Laura Spencer and she's not happy about it. Generally, when she's not happy to see someone at her door, it's Victor Cassidyne's face. And how funny is it, by the way, of what this medication has done to Victor in giving him a, a, a little... Uh, uh, I don't know how to say it delicately, uh, uh, l lowered capabilities as a man. I don't know. What's the nice way to word it? But they have definitely um, taken away his manhood. And can there be a more fitting revenge? It's very funny. Also on Friday, Sonny is brutally honest to someone. Maybe it's Dex. We'll see. And then we're going to end the week with Spencer doing some strategic thinking. The main goal he has right now is to get his hands on his baby brother, get the kid away from it, Esme, get the kid out of prison. So maybe he's doing strategic thinking about how to convince her, or maybe he's doing some strategic thinking to help Trina out. We'll just have to wait and see. But there's a big week of soap action in Port Charles coming. And that's all the spoilers we have for General Hospital the week of March 20th through 24th. Check out all of our spoiler articles on SoapDirt.com and check out here for more podcasts on your favorite ABC soap. Thanks for listening. 
thank you for being a loyal listener. Follow us wherever you get your podcast because you don't want to miss the next episode. Soap Dirt is on all the major podcast platforms, including Apple Podcast, Spotify, iHeartRadio, and more. 